Welcome to the JS Arms Co. High Point Picatinny Top Picatinny Rail Installation. I took my slide completely off the pistol. I've removed the two screws and the spring and the rear sight has now come free. You want to clean this really well with a Q-tip. Take this out of the package. If we have to remove any material from the Picatinny, remove it here and remove it there. You should not have to remove from here or any place else. I recommend you test fit first and you put it on and you know if it stop, stops like here that's because it's supposed to fit really really tight. You may need to take a piece of leather, a piece of cardboard, something so that you're not beating directly on the metal. A few taps with the hammer and it should be seated. You see it's seated down there's going to be just about a paper width left underneath here. You can get a fingernail underneath there. And that is so that you can actually get it off by getting a screwdriver and prying it off. If it's super ultra tight and you don't feel like it's fitting down snug enough, when you stick it, you beat it down, it can peel the paint a little bit as it goes down. So you want to take a sharp object and just kind of scrape anywhere inside the, the square part here. And then you want to take a Q-tip and clean out your scrapings, get it nice and clean, and you may have to rinse and repeat on that a couple of times. Once you get it down, it's nice and tight, you can take your screw with the little lock washer here and tighten it up. I recommend blue Loctite, um, not your wife's clear fingernail polish and not the red because if you use the red Loctite it may never come off again unless that's your goal. You tighten it up nice and tight and you flip over. What you want to do is you want to make sure that the screws are not sticking through into the doll's head channel where your, your um, spring is for your firing pin. You want to make sure there's nothing impeding that. Should be fine. If not, let me know. I'll get you another screw shorter one. If you have to remove any material, like I said, remove it from the side. You use your wife's emery claws, you can use a sanding block, you can use a big file, which I don't rec necessarily recommend, but if it's all you got, it's all you got. There's a jeweler's files that you can buy at Harbor Freight for like four bucks. Um, you can even scrape it a little bit with this, but that might rough up your surface. That's why I recommend trying to do the paint more than anything. Once you get it nice and tight and you're satisfied that it's on good and tight, Follow the manufacturer's instruction on your Loctite to give it time to cure. Because this thing, only though, the, although this rear, this red dot weighs about five and a half ounces, when this thing is going back at whatever speed it goes back at, that's a lot of weight that's trying to pull that off. And it will back the screws out. That's why we put the, the lock washer on, and I recommend the blue Loctite. Safe shooting. Have a great day.